Hi everyone, I hope you are all doing well. So let's see what is coming through for you. What do you need to know right now? So I'm going to start with taking some messages from the person on your mind. So please think of your person. Oh. I'm so mad at myself for how I've treated you. Okay. Okay, let's see. Workaholic. So some of you may be dealing with a workaholic or you may be workaholic. I pretended to be someone else. Dreaming about you. And one more card. Intense connection. Okay, so what I can see so far in here is the fact that um, there has been... So for some of you, you have been in a relationship, uh, if not in a situationship. Uh, you know, you are dealing with somebody who is a workaholic, as I mentioned before, or you could uh, be working a lot. Um, this person pretended to be someone else. Uh, either they had their walls up and they pretended to to be okay-ish, or, you know, or maybe you are dealing with somebody who is... Um, has a big pride, ego, but they are dreaming about you, you know, they really like you and they really feel this intense connection. So, for example, if uh, you're dealing with somebody who has a big pride and ego, obviously, although they are crazy about you and they really like you, they will not admit that because, you know, of their ego and pride. So, let's find out. There is a deck sign. Gemini. Okay, so let's see what tarot cards have to say. Let's click. Oh, okay. So we have seven of pentacles. Excuse me, seven of cups in reverse. We have five of cups in reverse as well. We have the phone in reverse. Okay, two more cards, please. Two more cards okay so the moon and one, one more card please okay too many cards came out um, I have the eight of swords I have the lovers and there was one more card in here no two more cards okay the lovers in reverse and I have the four of swords and i have the six of pentacles in reverse okay so what i can see so far from here is that uh, just as i mentioned before uh i think this person so if you were dealing with somebody that um so, uh, if you are in a relationship with this person, or you were in a certain sort of situation, or even if you have not been involved with them, you know, romantically, uh, and although you like them and they like you, this person has some sort of, of reality check, and they realize that they did something that they really, really upset you, um, and um, they're not in a very, very mad of themselves at the moment, and you know, they're not happy about what they did to you. Okay, now with the five of pentacles in reverse again i feel like if you were in a relationship with this person and you're in separation at the moment i feel like you are kind of moving forward or this person feels like you are moving forward and they're really really scared to lose you and obviously it depends what this person did to you in the past you know but they are really really scared to lose you and again with the full in reverse this is all about um risk so i feel like somebody here is taking a risk or they want to take a risk so uh, if you are in uh, a separation from this person i feel like they want to take a risk and come forward and try to fix these things but you, if you're not in a separation if it's just somebody that situation ship again i feel like uh this person will take some sort of risk and uh, come forward towards you because with the moon also moon sometimes can be uh finding our secrets so uh, hidden things come into light so if there is something hidden from you things will come you will find out something very soon regarding this person or maybe the the, the person on your mind could uh, find out something about you that has been kept uh, hidden from them if i can say that but the moon card it can also be like um um some sort of fear anxiety so for me i would say again this person um because they know they really did you wrong they are really really scared they are going to lose you or it could be vice versa. This could be your energy as well. They could have it resonates. With the Eight of Swords, again, if for some of you, 
if um, this is not a third party, because I do get a little bit of a third party energy in here as well. So if you're dealing with somebody who is in a third party situation, um, then, um, or you are in a third party situation, excuse me, then if somebody here is feeling trust, so for example, let's say this person is married and he or she, they have their own family and they wish they can come forward towards you, they are thinking to take a risk. But if, you know, thinking and actually taking an action, uh, it's slightly different, okay? But they they feel trapped at the moment, you know, they feel like they have this restriction again, third party situation. And it doesn't necessarily have to be another person or a family, it can be a mom, it can be their job, it can be, you know, a... Uh, living far away from each other okay so take it how it resonates you will uh, know if this reading is for you or not okay also uh with the lovers in reverse i feel like there is some sort of disconnect so just as i mentioned you know some of you have some sort of argument separation take it how it resonates and you know it really kind of i can pick up on this situation and uh, again, this card is all about something uh, coming to lies. So uh, if there were some lies uh, being told to you by this person or something being uh, kept hidden from you, again, you will find out about this. Don't worry about it. With the Four of Swords, I feel like this person, again, I have another card telling me that this person, they're really, really scared. So either they did something really wrong and they're really scared that you are going to find out and uh, they are going to lose you forever because this is what I'm picking up. I have two cards saying the same thing, that they are very scared, they're feeling very anxious because something's going to um, come to light. And um, shame. And also, I feel like for some of you, you know, uh, you are kind of... Um, starting to meditate, you know, you are kind of going deep within yourself, you know, you're doing your inner work, so keep doing that, that's always good. With the Six of Pentacles in reverse, I feel like somebody in here is going to get some sort of gift, so for some of you, this person might want to come forward and give you some sort of gift, um, they will try to make things up, depending on what exactly they did, you know, just as I mentioned before, they will take some sort of risk and will come forward and will try to fix things with you, and uh, if you are in separation or if you are argument or, you know, this is some sort of cycle going on between you, I feel like this person will come forward towards you, but I feel like, again, there will be kind of... If this is a cycle going on between you two, I feel like it will be okay for a while and then again it's going to be a hot and cold situation, leaving you out in and cold. Uh, it's totally up to you if you want to deal with somebody like that. Um, but for some of you, again, I feel like, uh, you know, if you feel like you, know, you need some sort of help, you will get this help. Um, you know, uh, this card is, is quite a positive card even though it's in reverse you know so the, it means gifts it means you know somebody be, being very generous towards you somebody being very kind very helpful towards you so uh for some of you i feel like oh if it got nothing to do with your personal life you know i feel like somebody's gonna come forward and help you if you're in a, going through a difficult time there's somebody here who want to be you know by your side and just help you in uh, every way they can so this is really a lovely reading so i really hope this video helped thank you so much for watching i'll see you soon in another video bye